What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a while, it's been like three months, um, but I decided I'd miss making videos and I wanted to get back into it. So what better way to start off than giving you guys a quick uh, update on what's been going on. All right, as you can see, here's the tank. Not a lot has changed. Uh, I think I've added an extra air stone in the middle there for some more oxygen. Um, but everyone's kind of hiding right now because I was just cleaning the glass, but they're all doing well. They've probably grown considerably since you last saw them. BB, my peacock bass here, is doing as uh, probably one of the biggest in the tank now. Um, three months ago, she was definitely a lot smaller. And Donald is also growing, my uh, red spotted gold severum. He's uh, doing great. But yeah, everyone's really happy. Everyone's enjoying themselves, having a great time together. <laughs> Very happy the way the tank is at the moment, but it's been like this for a couple months, so I feel like I need a change. So this video, what I want to do is I want to get some hazy a hazy background for the back of the glass so we don't see the wires um, from the, the air bubblers. And I also want to change some of the decorations around, um, you know, spice it up a bit. What I was thinking of doing is maybe kind of getting some, some decorations, some orange plants, kind of making it like a Halloween theme for Halloween coming up. So I think that'd be pretty cool. Okay, so step one is going to be to go to the fish shop and find some cool Halloween decorations for the tank. Um, I'm going to look for some, maybe some skulls, some treasure chests, some things like that. Normally I don't like fake decorations, but I'm going to give it a try, see how it works. If I don't like it, then I can always change it back. It's not a big deal. But before we do that, we just got to feed the fish. Alright, so it's now the next day and I was able to go to the shops and actually pick up quite a lot of cool stuff for the Halloween inspired um, fall tank. So this is what I got. So I've just laid them out on the couch here. First thing, we got a cool little octopus skull and these things, I know they're fake decorations and a lot of people do not like them, but I thought they were pretty cool and it kind of matches the whole Halloween theme. And I'm going to basically use them to cover up my air stones. Um, and I think that'll look a lot better than just having the blue ear stones out. So we got a nice treasure chest, a skull, a cool little no fishing thing. And then these funky plants that are like orange and, and kind of like dark blue purple. And then a whole bunch of other plants. Um, and these are just gonna match and go along with the, the current, well, plants, they're fake plants, obviously. Um, I don't know if any of you have kept cichlids before, but um, they eat real plants, so that's not an option. So if I want any kind of planted tank look, I have to go for the fake. Um, I've got quite a lot in here, so I'll probably end up taking some of the ones out, because um, I don't need all of them, and swapping them with these orange ones. Um, and I think that'll look really cool. So let's get started. Another guy who needs your boy hair clothes Do not worry, I can buy it all on I can pay everything I like and want Oh, I like and want I work so hard, yeah, so hard Focus, yeah, focus I don't need help, 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 help I'm not a billionaire or a millionaire all right, so this is my thought process. I want to take out this big piece of wood. It's taking up too much swimming space um, and I've got a smaller bit that I can put in a placement that looks a bit more spooky. I'm going to take out all these plant, all the plants, um, maybe rearrange the substrate so it's a bit higher up on this side um, and maybe figure out something to do with that piece of wood and then put in the new plants after I've washed them and the new decor um, and hopefully it'll be looking great. Baby, turn the wall away now I'm feeling something fine And 
All right, so we've been, we've made some good progress. I'm pretty happy with what we've come up with so far. Um, we've got a little middle section here. It's got some, the cool treasure chest, the skull with the things coming out, a little, our no fishing sign. We put a rock that I had in from a previous tank, which I think fits really well in there, just to, to make it accent a little bit, give it a little bit of personality. <laughs> um, and then we've got a cool corner here. I got another rock in there. It's kind of hard to see at the moment, but um, once the tank clears up, you'll be able to see it a lot more. Um, yeah, I think this looks pretty cool without it being too much fake decorations. Um, I think it's a good balance between natural and fake. Um, and I think it can work sometimes, especially when, you're, when I'm wanting to do the Halloween kind of theme. So this side of the tank, I'm happy with. On this side, I don't have enough um, decorations yet. So I'm gonna have to go back to the shop. Um, I saw some cool stuff there, which I really think would look great in here. So I think that'll be the next purchase. Um, but right now, this half, so that could probably be, that'll probably be a part two, to be honest, because I think this video will be long enough as it is. But yeah, this is what we're working with so far. Obviously I'll wait till it clears up and then I'll show you guys some, some proper footage once everything's cleaned up and out of the way. Um, I also, when I removed that old log that was here, it picked up so much dirt. So I'm gonna have to siphon all that out. Um, so I'm gonna do that now and then fill the tank back up and let the fish settle for a bit because they seem pretty stressed out at the moment. Okay, so it's been a day since I uh, put all the new decorations in and that's been enough time for the water to settle and clear up. Um, and I think the fish are really enjoying it. So let me give you guys a final look. Here it is. Um, I think it's looking great. I like the, the skull with the, the no fishing sign. I think the fish are loving it. Um, and it's great because it gives the fish a lot more swimming space. Um, so I think they get a bit more of a break from each other, which is quite good. Um, yeah, I think it's looking really cool. So the way I see it is this, the right side of the tank is finished and then the left side of the tank still needs work. I saw some cool things at the fish store, which I can get. So that's probably gonna have to be done in another video. Um, and I wanna make it more blue and kind of contrast it from the orange. I think that'll look really cool. Like bluey, dark purples um, to give it a, a bit more of a different color. Um, so kind of change in the middle. But yeah, um, this is how it's looking for right now. I'm very happy with the way it's turned out. Um, and I think so are the fish. All right, so that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I'll definitely be doing part two um, soon where I change this side of the tank. Um, I did also get a hazy background for the glass, but I decided I really didn't like it, the look of it. So uh, I just left that part out. But yeah, this is the tank. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more content and I will see you guys in the next video.